All right, now we're doing 8Q job matching number one. This is by D. Nolan, and 85% of the people like it. We're going to be make, building a matchmaking system that helps discover jobs for developers based on a number of factors. Uh, we're going to create a function that we're going to create a function match, which takes a candidate and a job, and we'll return a boolean indicating whether the job is a valid match for the candidate. Uh, the minimum salary will, will be this. This is the maximum salary. Uh, down here, we're going to find out. We're going to see if the minimum salary and the maximum salary are even, are even present. Uh, throwing an, L, an error if otherwise, and then there's also going to be a 10% wiggle room deducted from the candidate's minimum salary. That's not good negotiation at all. <laughs> That's a terrible negotiation. Uh, to that, to yeah, you want to you want to always go up. You never want to go down. D Nolan, you want to go up. <laughs> anyway, uh, just my opinion. Anyway, so first things first, we're going to take care of this. See if they're present. Uh, so we're going to say. Pardon me. We're going to use one of these throw statements, which throws a user defined exception. And uh, basically, you make an if set statement with the exception inside of it, and then you're going to throw an error of sorts. All right. So we're going to say if uh, what is it? Candidate dot min salary exists. So candidate dot min salary, and in front of that, we're going to just put a uh, not operator and then not uh, jobs job dot max salary right and if these don't exist if either of them don't exist we're gonna throw error all right and then we're gonna do the return statement and this is the easy part so we're gonna say uh, if candidate dot min salary times 0.9 is less than or equal to uh, job.max salary. If that's the case, then true if not false. Test it out. All right, it works. Attempt it. All right, good. Submit it. All right, very much like this. Let's go to my solutions. Best practice, in my opinion. Make sure that uh, when you're in an interview, when you're negotiating salary, no matter what they say, uh, just get to the part where they offer you the position and then say, look, I need some more money. <laughs> because, you know, it, you get them to a point where you've got the leverage. You know, like they're willing to hire you. Time to say, give me more money. You know what I'm saying? Or no deal. They will work with you. I guarantee it. Business is about negotiation. All right, and uh, we'll see you next time.